want you guys to never take a look at how to join the Brightech Discord server for a chat with myself and many other people. So if you want to join the Discord server, head over to discord.com and you can download the Discord server for Windows or you can use it in a browser, but you're probably best to get the download for Windows version because that way it's a little bit more stable. So let's go ahead and take a look once you get Discord installed. So once Discord is installed, go to some of my latest videos and you will see inside the video description, there will be a link for Discord. You can see Discord access right here. So in the video description of my very latest video, it has to be the latest video because some of the older videos have the old Discord server that don't work anymore. So once you have copied the actual link, go to add and basically join a Discord server and you can then paste in the link right here and you can click join server. What this is going to do is join you to our server. It will populate on the screen as you can see right here and you're going to get what to do when you join this community. You can be a part of the tech community or be a big fan of Brightech. Whatever it is you want to say here, you can choose one of these options. Either one of these options will do, and this will then take you to the next screen where you would be able to read and agree to the server rules. This is to protect me, you, and everyone else that's using the Discord server. So click on finish and it will bring you to the server guide page. The server guide page is where you get access to read the rules right here. And there's also about page, there's an invite button and there's also some resources, information, server rules, and you've got this information right here for the person that's joining. Down below, you've got the get started part. It says introduce yourself to the community. You can just click on this and it will take you straight to the general area where you can say hi to all of the members that are in the Discord server. You may get a response, you may not, depending on who's online at that particular time. You can go back to the very top, right on the left, and get to the Get Started area, and this is where you can check out some of the latest announcements. This could be announcements on server changes, or it could be announcements on giveaways, or other things like that. So just keep an eye on the announcements area. So let's go back up to the top left hand side where it says get started and up here we can click on this and it says open up a ticket here if you need help from staff. If you need any help from staff you can click on this area here and it will take you to the ticket area where you can open up a ticket. This is not for PC repair or PC support, this is for asking questions about the server or how to use the server and things like that and you can ask the staff member for help. Now on the left is access to all of the rooms that you have, the community rooms, the voice channel rooms, and also YouTube member rooms and stuff like that. So all of these will be listed here. There's a show all button down the bottom, which you can click on, and it will show you all of these. Up the very top, there's the server guide area, and this will give you general information about the server. Server rules, it just gives you some uh, basic rules about the server and what we try to abide by. And make sure we have a friendly safe place for everyone on the information guide here it gives you a brief uh, understanding of some of the rules some of the roles and some of the tech support help and some of the things like that you may need to know about giveaways and all this sort of stuff this will be found right here there's an invite button here if you want to invite other people to the server and you can generally just access all of the rooms by going to channels and roles here up the very top and if you look here you'll be brought to this top area where we can go to browse channels. Inside here, there's a load of check marks in some of the rooms. You might see tech support area is unchecked marked. What you want to do is check mark these or follow the channel uh, category, and this will allow you to gain access to it and show all of the rooms here. There's a YouTube members area for YouTube members where they can gain access to this area and this will be a locked area for only YouTube members. There is other voice channel areas which you can use, but once you've selected all of these, you can now start using the Discord server. So let's start from the very top. We have the information area, which is your welcome area. When people are joining the server, they will be in the welcome area here. And we also have announcements area as well. So these are new members that have been joining, and you can see that's what will show up here. Announcements is what I've already talked about. You can basically check this every once in a while if there's announcements. The boost area is if you boost the area through Nitro, this will show up on the server inside here. Support ticket, we've already talked about this. This is if you want to open up a ticket for a server related issue, this will open up a private room where you and the staff member will only be able to see it. Next, we have the community area for general chat, also technology chat right here. We also have the memes area to post memes inside here. We have a food section where you can post pictures of your food or food that you've uh, had when you've been out. 
there's an area right here. We have a car section where you can post pictures of cars or wallpaper of cars. We have a wallpaper section, which has some really cool wallpapers. There's literally hundreds of them inside here. You can download these and use them on your computer. We also have your PC setup. You can post pictures of your setup of your computer and share that with the community. Right Tech videos, these are my latest videos that I do. So every time I release a video, it will automatically be posted in the Bright Tech videos area. Bot commands, this is where you can control the bot for things like the checking up your rank or checking up the leaderboard and other things like that. You can use the uh, bot commands area to do all of that. It's pretty simple to do. You just do the forward slash rank and you'll be able to then click on the username that you want to check. So for instance, let's check Brightech here. Click on this one, push enter, and you can check it for other people or you can check it for yourself. Just that simple. I'll be adding a little bot on here for games because some people like to play the uh, blackjack and things like that. I'll add that bot onto the server very shortly and basically you'll be able to play little uh, games on the bot. Now, if you have a video request, we have a video request section. This means that you're asking me to make a video on a particular topic or or something like that, and you can add it right in here. You've probably got more chances of it being made if we post it in that section because posting it in the comments doesn't make it that easy for me to see. Also, inside here, we've got useful guides. I'll be adding loads of useful guides in here for quick things like uh, batch files and things like that. Also levels, you've got your levels for the server levels, deals. These will be where we post any technology deals. Inside the tech support area, you can read this little informational area here. This will tell you exactly what we expect for tech support. It's not a right, it's a privilege. So just go ahead and open up a tech help area here and you can click on and you'll see there's been tons of help already given to people that have had issues. Now be respectful to people that are helping you for free. Do not DM people to ask for help in DMs, otherwise you will be kicked. This is basically where you would ask for help inside here. Just click on new post, give it a title, give it a title that is recognizable and give us as much information as possible to try and help you. It's that simple. Don't just say I need help as ASAP and then go offline. Otherwise your, your ticket will be closed and you won't um, be responded to. Be patient. We do live in different time zones, so not always are going to be people online to help you immediately so just post it inside here and someone will get to it as soon as they're free and this is a very common and popular area where people like to hang out inside the tech support area but like i said sometimes people are impatient and they want help immediately and people are just not always available so like i've said before just be patient and be respectful if if you're going to be posting something up here just Give as much information as you can about what's actually happening and what you've tried and people can help you better. You can read some of the other posts on here if you think you can help with those. You can always jump on and help out as well. Also, what I want to say here is there's a voice chat area for everyone to join. And again, there is some voice chat rules here. Try to follow these rules. I have disabled right now the actual ability to share your screen. And the reason for that is because people were showing adult content and if I catch you doing that or someone reports you doing that, I will ban you from the server and you will be reported. This is not a place for sharing that type of content. So remember, if you're in the voice chat area, you'll be using the voice text. And this means that when you're talking to people, you'll be posting up links and images and things like that. And you can just join it by clicking on it like so. And basically, we have a trusted role. If you are trusted, I will give you access to share your screen. So if you're streaming a game, you can gain access that way. But use the voice text area when you're generally talking about things that you're talking about in the voice area. Also, there's a YouTube members area. This is for people that want to gain access to it. You can read all this information right here. It will explain exactly how you can gain access to that. If you see people sitting in there chatting, that means they're a YouTube member and they've paid for YouTube membership on YouTube. And that will give them access to the private area where if people want to chat in more privacy and more quiet, this will be the place to be. But again, people do use the general uh, voice chat area, which doesn't cost you anything. There's a show all button right here. Click on this and it will show all of the rooms and you'll be able to see everything right there. It's right away down the bottom. So that's how you can gain access to the new Brightech server. If you fancy joining for a chat or maybe you've got some sort of video request or you just want to uh, come on and join the community, then by all means, use the link in the video description. So if you fancy a chat, 
or you have questions or you just want to join a tech community, then this is the place to join. All the link is in the video description. Just remember, we do have some server rules in place, obviously, to keep this place a safe environment for everyone. Again, just use your common sense, really. Uh, read the rules and pretty much follow those and you should be pretty much good to go. Anyway, with that said, I think that's going to be about it. Hopefully, we will see you on the Discord server for a chat and I shall catch you in the next one. Thanks again for watching. Bye for now.